Welcome to the third installment of my series of videos on applying right left bass to your drum set. Simple figure, three notes, but just endless possibilities. So in this one, we're going to apply right left bass as a straight 16th note, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. So let's get right to the first basic exercise, which is one measure long, right left bass four times, and then right left right bass on four E and a to turn the exercise back around to one. I'll step a chord note in the hi-hat. Ready and play and. On the kit, three and four and. I want to stress that I'm also using full strokes. But I'm playing the exercise right now, so I'm letting the stick have as big a rebound as it possibly can, as opposed to getting the stick stuck down near the drum head. Okay, so that figure can instantly become a uh, fill. You can play a couple measures of groove. Three, four, and And we'll move on to playing the right left bass over the bar line. So we'll just keep playing right left bass over and over. It'll take three measures to come back to one. One, two, ready and play and. I'll go straight from there to improvising with that figure. Change dynamics, change your orchestration, what sound you hit, and then when comfortable, as always, the last thing I start to change is the sticking. Rights and lefts, slams, unison hands is always good. One, two, ready, and play, and. Here's a groove just using right left bass. I'm going to play a one measure groove. I'm going to start the figure with the bass drum for the extra note, the 16th note, and then it'll also end in the bass drum. So it'll go. Right hand on the hi hat. Accent on two. And also an accent in the left hand on the end of four. I'll play it on the remote hi-hat so you can see how it relates to quarter note. One, two, three, four. Probably a more usable idea is to take a groove that you're really comfortable with and insert a small right left bass figure at the end of the groove. So say I play a bar and a half of simple time and on the last three E and a four E and a, I'll play right left bass, right left bass, right left. One, two, three, four.
In these three videos, we've covered this small three note figure in a variety of ways. We've played it as a eighth note triplet, played it as a swung eighth note, and we've played it as a straight sixteenth note. And the funny thing is, it's just scratching the surface for ideas. We could just sit here all day and come up with some new way to use these three notes. You could play a drum and bass beat or something faster, you, you know, any time feel. You could play some metal or a blast beat or some sort of uh, South American music, play it with a samba, a bossa nova, a mambo. There's just so many ways you can use this figure. So it's up to you to take these ideas, practice these exercises, and then definitely come up with your own unique ideas and how to use this. Thank you so much for watching. Check out theducksmusic.com for other videos, and I'll see you next time.